Yo, what is up, guys? It is Illusion Modding, and today I'm going to be showing you guys a quick tutorial on how to RTM on a Kex or Dex PS3. Again, your PS3 has to be jailbroken, um, so let's go ahead and get into it. You're going to need two things. One is the, um, the PC version of Control Console, and the other one is the PS3 version of Control Console, which is the um, PKG package file. So you can go to this link down in the description, which is a next gen update link, or you can search your own. It's really easy to find this. It's Control Console. Um, the current version is 2.70. I recommend getting 2.60. It's the best one in my opinion. All basically all tools use it. I don't know many that use 2.70, but um, it has a list of the supported firmwares and shit like that. Um, so anyways, so and then you're gonna want to have that on your P PC. What the hell? Okay, so you want to open it up on your PC, which I have it right here. Okay. Now, you're going to need the IP of your PS3, not your actual routers, you know, modems, whatever the fuck you want to call it. It's IP. You just need the PS3 IP. So, you, all you have to do is go to all the way to the left and then go down to System Settings. Or, not my bad, not my System Settings, but Network Settings. And then Settings and Connection Status List. And then you'll see their IP address and you just type that in and then it'll let you... And then that's basically what you do. And you can add the console, you can name it, whatever the fuck you want. But before you're able to connect to it, you have to go onto your PS3, and I'll show you what you have to do right now. PS3, all you have to do is go over to um, install package files. Fucking fucking find it there. It's package manager. And then go to install package files. And then standard. And then, yeah, that's it. You just install it. You have to have it on your root of your USB. And then that's it. And then when you have to go over to your, um, you know, where your homebrew apps, if you have it in a folder or whatever, and then click on Control Console. It's gonna tell you what it's gonna do and everything, and it's gonna ask you to install it. And that's basically it. It's gonna reboot your PS3, and then you're gonna be back on your XMB. And then after that, you want to go back to your um, PC, which I am right here. Let's go ahead and minimize that. Okay. So once you're on your PC again, as you see, I already have the PS3's IP in there. And you just want to right click and click connect. And it'll say connected to PS3 VPN or whatever the fuck yours is. And you can refresh it, you know, to check your cell temperature, you know, what version you are and all that shit. And then, okay, so the last thing is how to connect a RTM tool, which is kind of like a part of that. And all you have to do, which, you know what I mean, you just get whatever fucking RTM you want, which I'll just use, um, NV. Not NV, Geo. It's a BO2 tool, I'm not even on Black Ops 2, but I know I can connect it. Okay, so once you're on this, you just want to click CCAPI. If you're on Dex, you can do TMAPI. I don't use it because I, I fucking hate it, honestly. It's a fucking pain in the ass. You just click on CCAPI and click Connect. And then it'll say Connect, and then it'll bring up this little box. And it's going to have your PS3's, um, you know, your name and then your IP address. You click on that. And then you go down to Connect. Connection. I don't know the fuck it doesn't say connect, but it doesn't. And you'll connect. And I'll say you are now connected to this tool. And sometimes it will say it up on the PS3, but I don't think this one does. And another thing. Oh, yeah, I see it does. It says BO2, BO2 tool and shit like that. Another thing that you can do just, you know, as, as you know, precaution. A lot of people do this, you know, for proof that you have a jailbreak and shit. You can go to memory. No, it's not memory. I think it's system. Okay, and then you can type in something. What I mean by that, like you can type in illusion modding. Okay, and as you'll see up on the PS3, it'll come up illusion modding. So yeah, that's a quick little quick little tutorial. It's not really that hard. Um, if you are having any trouble with it, you make you want to make sure that your firewall, like sometimes that could be blocking connection because your PC has to be able to connect to your PS3 via your router and shit like that. So it has to be able to have an internet connection. You know what I mean? The shit's not blocking it. Um, with the VPN, it's the same way. I already made a tutorial on that. Um, but yeah, guys, this is Illusion Modding. Stay cool, stay modding, and peace out, guys.